Hi guys, in this video we will see how to fix Microsoft account login error code 0x8004882020 on Windows 11 and Windows 10. If you are also facing such type of error, Microsoft account login failed, then here are the fixes. Right click on a start button and choose settings. Here in settings phase from the left side, go to Windows update and click on check for updates of or any pending updates available simply download it install it first check for updates and if any update available then download it and install it in your system sometimes outdated operating system may be a cause of various type of login error failed you can receive though so update your os first the second one is right click on a start button and choose run in run dialog box type the command wsreact.exe this command will re clear your Microsoft Store catches. So second workaround is clear your Microsoft Store catches by applying wsrect.exe command in run dialog box and close the windows and check whether your Microsoft account login failed error resolved or not. If not, go to the next fixes. Open control panel in your system and here click on date and time. date and time page will open here from the top menu bar go to internet time and this computer is set to automatically synchronize on a scheduled task choose change settings and make sure that synchronize with an internet time server is duly checked and click on update now please wait while synchronization with the times.windows.com is in process and error occurred because you have already updated with your time server in your system if it is not updated then update it close the windows and check whether your microsoft account login failed error resolved or not if not go to the next fixes open your google chrome browser and check microsoft's account server status microsoft server status type in search field Microsoft server status, press enter and open first result service status. Click on it and check globally Microsoft server is in on or down. Here you will find we all are good. Everything is up and running. If you found any error and server is down, wait till server is up. Close the windows. And check whether your error is resolved or not if not go to the next fixes right click on a start button and here choose settings here from the left side of settings go to accounts from the right side I scroll down and click on your info and here make sure that correct ID and you have successfully login with your correct administrator account. If not, then change correct account login. Thereafter, close the windows and check whether your error is resolved or not. If not, go to the next fixes. Right click on a start button and choose settings again. Here from the left side, go to network and internet. From the right side, click on VPN and make sure that allow VPN over meter connection, allow VPN while roaming is disabled. And if you have added any VPN connection, remove it. Same, go back and look for the option proxy, click on it and disable proxy settings also. Automatically detect settings, make sure that it is turned off. So disable VPN connection and disable proxy connection. After that, your problem should be definitely be resolved. That's all.